Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Yesterday on the 9th of February 2021, Microsoft released KB4601319. That is the latest cumulative update for Windows 10 versions 2004 and 20H2. And that also takes us to the second patch Tuesday of the year. Now it is a relatively small update and it is a security update and includes quality improvements and some of those key changes, and I'm reading from the support website, some of those key changes include fixed a possible elevation of privilege vulnerability in the Win32 component, fixed an issue that might damage the file system of some devices and prevent them from starting up after running check disk space forward slash F, fixed a security vulnerability by by preventing applications that run as a system account from printing to file ports. So it is a security update, a relatively small one uh, this month. And uh, those are some of the key changes I have just mentioned. Now, if you would like to see if you have the update, go to your search box and type in settings. In settings, navigate to update and security. And if you don't see anything under Windows Update, you can just check for updates and that will download them and then you will be able to install from there. And then if you would like to see if you have the update, just go to View Update History and you can see Quality Updates, Cumulative Update for Windows 10 version 20H2, KB4601319. And that is a security update. Uh, update this month which patches some security holes and flaws and uh, it is there's no uh, feature changes or cosmetic changes to Windows 10 it is not a feature update it is just a security update and then you can see underneath here there's another one cumulative update for .NET framework 3.5 and 4.8 KB4601050 now that also is a security update for .NET Framework 3.5 and 4.8 on Windows 10 versions 20H2 and 2004. So if you're running that, that also patches some security flaws in your system. Now, for whatever reason, um, this update causes problems on your system and your machine and you have experience in problems and you would like to uninstall it, you just go to view update history and you go to the top to uninstall updates and you just scroll down to the bottom where it says Microsoft Windows and you can see here KB4601319 that is the latest cumulative update and then the .NET framework KB4601050 if any of those are giving you problems you just click on it and go uninstall and follow the prompts. It's not recommended to uninstall a security update because obviously Microsoft releases these security updates on Patch Tuesday for a reason and they are to um, fix critical security flaws some, sometimes on your system. So only uninstall an update if you are really experiencing problems on your machine. And then lastly, if we just go back into our settings and we go system, and we just scroll down to about. You can see now the build for Windows 10 version 20H2 is now 19042.804. And for Windows 10 2004, that will be 19041.804. So that is the latest build number for Windows 10 version 20H2. Ma update went relatively well. I so far have experienced um, no problems with this update and everything seems to be running smoothly as I speak and I hope it goes well with you as well. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.